Next to Hartsfield Jackson International Airport, where hundreds of flights were delayed or canceled along the East Coast, the wait times to get through security at their worst at Hartsfield Jackson grew to more than an hour. Let's go live to Kim Smith at the airport watching the conditions. Kim, what do you got for us? Yeah, I can tell you some good news here. Security lines have gone down to under 15 minutes to get through the TSA security checkpoint. So that's good news for the passengers trying to get through the airport here at Hartsfield Jackson. Now, as for the check in lines, they're still quite quite a long line over at Southwest's check in area. Now, many of those passengers passengers are trying to just rebook their flights right now so that they can get on the next available flight with all of those cancellations. Southwest has canceled 100 flights today. Now, total flights going out of Hartsville Jackson Airport, 653 cancellations, 1114 delays. Now, the story tonight are the people that are just trying to camp out, hang on to their next flight. So I found a few friends here. They have been with us for a very long time, waiting for their flight, Denise and Christy. And you guys were on Southwest flights, but now you're trying to camp out and wait for the next available flight, right? Yes, the next available flight is not until tomorrow, 1 o'clock. Oh, wow. So, yes, um, so we are going to come in early. I mean, we're going to stay out here because we really don't want to leave the airport because if we do, then we have to, you know, try to get back and, and be here because we're going to be here bright and early because um, they told us to come in and check our bags in at 8 a.m. to see if we can be on standby for a noon flight. So, but we are confirmed for 1 o'clock tomorrow. So we're going to be here at the airport all night. And, and you've been here for a long time today. Yes. How long have you guys been here? Well, we got here about 2 o'clock. We spent three and a half hours in line praying for a for just praying for a flight. So um, they're just being patient and, and you know, we yes. just want to be safe. As you guys try to get back to Dallas, we wish you best of luck as you try to get back on the, your next flight to on the next Southwest flight for you Thank tomorrow. You. So we uh, officials here at the airport say between two to four hours, please plan in advance as you're trying to catch these flights today and tomorrow. Back to you guys. Wow, you have to feel a lot of sympathy toward those ladies. Thank you.